Hi, in this video, I'm going to be explaining the SAE steel grades. So there are nine major classifications of steel, and these nine include one being carbon, two being nickel, three being nickel chromium, four being molybdenum, and so on and so forth all the way up to nine. Now the SAE uses a four digit standard to classify these different steels. The first digit is what we just saw. It's the steel type and there are nine of them. The second digit tells you the modifications made to it. If it's a zero, it means no modification. If it's a one, it means it's resulfurized. Two is resulfurized and rephosphorized, so on and so forth. The third and fourth digit tell you right then and there the amount of carbon in 0.01% increments. So if the third and fourth digit are a 3 and a 0, then you would know that there's 0.30% carbon. So for this example, we're just going to look at carbon. Now this, what I'm showing here, is an example of a steel material. Now the first number here means that the steel type is carbon because carbon steel is the number one for the material. That's its material number. The zero here, the second digit, means the modification. And as you could see, it's not treated because it's a zero. And the last two numbers, as we saw before, it explains the carbon content. So you can see that this is 0 0.10 carbon content because it's telling you the carbon content in 0.01% increments. Let's look at another example. This is also a steel. It has a one for the second digit, which means it's resulfurized, and it has a 0.44% carbon content. And let's look at one last example. This steel type is carbon again, there's no modification because this is a zero, and this is a 0.45% carbon content. So once you get to understand this four-digit uh, system and what it can explain to you, it becomes very simple to look through a, a large list of different materials and to be able to choose the material that you need based on the parameters that you're looking for. The best thing about it is that the type of material is the first number and the and the last two digits are the carbon content so you get a great amount of information about that material right from the get-go and the second digit tells you what type of modification has been made uh, so this is a very helpful uh, system um, i hope you got a lot of value out of this video and let me know in the comments um, if you want to see any sort of video in the future thank you